Hey, uh, we're back to old school holding the camera video. I had a discussion with Vic Hybrid Power the other day um, about bitcoins. And I thought I can throw a computer together and mine some bitcoins. I'll make some money. I thought. And um, well, I'm not making any money. It's been to about two days now, and one of those days I had the wrong username and password inserted. Um, so I'm only making, I'm only actually doing 56 mega hashes per second, which is well relatively crap. And look at that, 24 hours. I've made 0.000001 of a Bitcoin. I think that equates to like one cent. Now, let's put that in perspective. We hit this little button here a few times. It's pulling 800, uh, 200 and say 220 watts. And it's pulled, pulled 5.9 kilowatts. So I've used a dollar fifty worth of electricity and made one cent. Before I even pay for the hardware, which I didn't pay for because let's face it, I have computers everywhere. Um, so that's an old, oh, that's, that's a really old gaming card. I paid a lot of money for that gaming card quite a few years ago. It's an old GTX 28, what I know, sorry, 285 video card. It's been a good card. But I don't think it likes this operation too much. Now before I put that extra little fan there and another fan down there, it was running at about 65 degrees. So she's running hot and I pulled it apart, put new thermal paste on it, Arctic Silver, cleaned all the air galleries and all this other stuff, still running hot. So, I'm going to do the next seven days, see how much money I can make from this computer running 24 hours a day and see how much money I can make. Now I've just bought this which is a new ATI card, which apparently, and I'm not really organized. I'm trying to keep stuff off camera I don't want to have on camera. Um, how much was that? Um, just under 200 bucks. And, wait a minute. I'm reading off paperwork on XGC. So it's an Asus R76360. Radeon card. So I'm going to put that in there now, and we got 56 mega hashes, so I'm going to see how much that improves in a few minutes time. Okay, so new card going in, old car coming out, um, it's going to be interesting to see how much less power this one uses too, it's going to be faster and use less power I should imagine, so let's do this. Dum -de 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 -da -da -da. Jesus, this is taking a long time. More updates in a minute. No, that's ridiculous. Don't put that on the video. Well, just a few minutes later, it's running 50 watts less, so 50 watts less. Temperature's a lot less, and it's been running long enough to do a valid test on that. So the temperature's down by 10 degrees, 50 there, and I got more than four times mega hashes so i'm going to do a quick video for the next week or so and just as a matter of interest i'm using gui miner on a windows 10 based computer and the screen's gone off already to save power um so i'll do i'm going to do a video every day for the next week on this and see how much money i don't make as compared to power that i use and hardware that i just spent 200 bucks on Alright, so I have a bit, a bit of a play around with the software and I found clock control where I can overclock it. So I did. A lot. I overclocked it all the way up to there, which is the maximum. And check this. Where is it? There it is. 269 mega hashes, so it's come up even higher. I am pretty impressed well the card will probably die but I'm impressed so I've got that turned all the way up um, I've also got see if I can get it in frame 
memory all the way up, and I've got the video card to manual control, uh, the, the fan control to, to 100%, so the fan just runs 100% all the time. So that um, seems to be working very well. So definite improvement on not overclocking the video card. I've never overclocked a video card in my life, and I thought, well, why not? And from this morning, let's see if we can get it in frame. This is sort of yesterday and this morning. I was getting seven point oh, seven zeros and a six, whatever that is, and then three, three, five, and two from the bottom up. And then after I changed the card, there's a definite improvement. I'm quite happy with that. Um, even though I've overclocked the card, there's only about 10 watts more being used on the electricity side of things. And uh, there we go. And the video card's about the same temperature. So that's an improvement. I'll run that for a couple of days still and um, see where we end up. Thanks, YouTube.